This is how boys live. He goes to bed every night, looks out the window, sees Kendrick Lamar looking at him dismissively, and he tucks himself into bed, and he goes, tomorrow will be the day where I grind. Yes, it's been a while since I've made a video, and I'm sorry about that, but I'm here now, and uh, I'm not gonna make, and let's just get on with the video. Hmm. Interesting. Anyway, here's a good male living space. You have a fan for ambient noise and to stay cool. You have a bed on the floor. Who needs a bed frame when you just have a bed? It's not a big deal. And you have a backpack over there. This is clearly a college guy who knows how to save money. This guy clearly got into a car accident. And when he got to the scrapyard, he took the car seats out of his car, put them in his dorm, and set it next to his iron block looking at mini fridge. I'm gonna be honest with you, this is a good idea. Boys, take notes. I enjoy this one because this is clearly a large house, but bro, couldn't afford or just didn't have enough furniture, so he just got cardboard boxes and a, and a couch that he found on the curb. Absolutely nothing wrong with the setup. It's functional, therefore it's good. Temporary room setup in a basement. Yeah, true boys, true men know that this is not temporary. This will last until the day you die. 10 out of 10. I enjoy this one in particular because you can tell bro was about to just chill out and watch a movie and he was like, you know, I need to, something's up with my living space. I'm going to go to take to Reddit and see what's up. And then as soon as he posted this, he sat back down on the floor and watched the movie. This simple setup leaves lots of room for activities. Imagine the stuff that this guy could do. He could start a meth lab like in Breaking Bad. He could play with Legos. He could play with Hot Wheels. He could start a setup too. But at the end of the day, he has a small bed and a good amount of space to play. Bro, the way I talk about men, it seems like we just never seem to grow up mentally. I apologize for the low-ass quality on this picture, but it's on TikTok, and I'm not about to make a TikTok account just to get this picture in high quality, so take it or leave it. Anyway, this guy seems to be worried about how ugly the back of the TV makes the room look. But, bro, it doesn't matter, man. It's not about the, it's not about that. It's about the experience. It's not about the bad quality of the game. It's about the experience of the game. Bro, I swear to God, I can't talk or something. Guys, I gotta be real with you. I'm getting a little sick of these women coming in here and hating on our living spaces. Look at this guy. He has a chair. He has a shelf. That's kind of huge. And a coat rack. And a light. Like, dude, that, I'm okay with that. All moved in under r slash male surviving space. You know, I didn't even know that subreddit was a thing, but I think I like it even more. This one's solid, because this guy doesn't even need to buy blinds, he uses his clothes as blinds. And I like how clean this one is compared to others. This guy, with a room this tidy and clean on the floor, he could have a, 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 a woman over. Now that's kind of huge. A place to sit, uh, something to watch, and something to play, and a place to do it in. Right here we have the main essentials of a man's life. Only thing it needs is a mini fridge and some takeout. That's all you need. This is a pretty good male living space. It has a nice cozy bed, has some cool decorations, and you have a cool light on the ceiling. Honestly, I would live I would live in this room. I would sleep in this room. Now, of course, this is just a random picture I found on the internet, you know, just through my searching. But based upon what we see here, he seems to be a, a well-put-together feller, if you ask me. Sweaty moon. This guy looks like he's ready to go camping at, at a moment's notice. He has a chair, he has a box, and he has looks like camping gear with plenty of shoes. So, I mean, this guy is a man's man, man. Just moved into a one-bedroom apartment after a seven-year relationship. Man, it's time for a fresh start, and why not start simple? And, well, it starts simple with men, and then it stays simple with men. That's just how it works. And there ain't a damn thing wrong with it. This is not a male living space. This is a male control station. Give it five years. This guy's going to outer space. All right, this is huge. This guy has two beds. Yeah, they don't have bed frames, but the point is he has two beds. Now, that's pretty amazing, and I gotta give, I gotta give props to this guy. He has a desk blinds or excuse me curtains and two beds current bedroom i feel like this this title this this word here current is not it, it means forever it's like currently it looks like this but we both know that it's not changing it's gonna stay like this and besides what's wrong with this you got two chairs a setup and a place to sleep and you have some natural light coming in honestly man keep it up all right before i end the video i just want to apologize for not uploading uploading a video in over a month uh, i'm sorry to the people who are scratching at their necks for a new video from me but uh, I'm gonna try my best to make more. So if you guys like more, if you guys like these, I'll make more. So I'm gonna end the video now. Um, see you guys later. <laughs>